TCP connect scan. When TCP connection scan perform, NMAP will utilize the three-way handshake mechanism to identify state of a port or ports. The three-way handshake mechanism is shown here. Source will going to send sync packet to the destination and in return the destination will going to send another packet which is sync plus ec or synac or synchronization and acknowledgement packet. The source will going to send back an acknowledgement packet to the destination. The, once the communication, once the three-way handshake is done, connection will going to establish and data transmission will perform. Let's take it practically with the Nmap. Nmap has an argument which is hyphen S capital T. To identify the three-way handshake mechanism workflow, I'll be using Wireshark. Wireshark is a packet analyzer tool or a network analyzer tool, which identify or scan real-time traffic for the network. The destination system is connected to my ETH0 network and I'll be choosing the same. Wireshark has started packet analyzing or packet capturing for the all ETH0 network. Let's start the scan. Nmap has done with the scan part. To identify the communication, I will choose any of the port from the listed below. Here, I'll go with the 80 port to filter the same. Using this filter, Wireshark will going to show only port number 80 output for the entire network. And here, the communication has been captured by the Wireshark. As shown earlier, TCP three-way handshake will going to send from first sync packet to the destination. And here, sync packet has been successfully sent. Once destination receives the sync packet, a sync and acknowledgement packet is returned by the destination. Then Source will going to send another packet as an acknowledgement and connection will establish. However, the scan does not require connection establishment as NMAP will going to send another packet which is RST or RST with acknowledgement to break the connection and move further.